Good morning, Pioneers. Today's Friday, April 3rd, day five of online school. You've almost made it to the end of your first week. I wanna tell you two things before we start announcements. I really miss you. This place is just not the same without kids. It's very boring. And secondly, I want to tell you what a great job you're doing. Your teachers are talking about the great work that you're doing. Attendance has been really terrific, and you're following directions and doing great work. So keep it up. At this time, we will have Peer Minister Maria Blumendahl lead us in prayer. Psalm chapter 56, verse 9 reminds us, The very moment I call to you for a father's help, the tide of the battle turns and my enemies flee. The one thing I know, God is on my side. Lord, help us to remember that this psalm stood true in biblical times, and it proves true in this day as well. Though there are great fears surrounding the threat of the disease, we can rest assured knowing that we have a Father in heaven who is with us in all things. Lord, this is true especially today with the spread of the coronavirus. We call you today, Lord, and ask that you stay at our sides. Amen. Thank you, Maria. Birthday Today's birthdays. To Happy birthday to sophomore Happy Alexand birthday Alexander Dijinsky and freshman oh, Alicia Latin and seventh grader Happy Landon Cotton Cottingham. Birthday. Hope you have a great day. Wish them a happy birthday. birthday. Reach out, send them a text. Happy birthday. Oh, Unfortunately, it is not going to be a very nice day today. It might already be snowing where you are. I know in Grand Forks they are supposed to get 10 inches of snow today. I'm glad I'm not there today. We will only have a high temperature of about 38. It's supposed to rain all morning and turn into a rain and snow mix this afternoon. Not a great day for a walk or a bike ride, I'm afraid. Couple reminders. Remember to read and follow the teacher's directions carefully about how to turn in your work. Your teachers will give you specific directions about the, how they would like you to submit your work. Please, please follow those directions. Thank you. Jack Hartman says cowboy dance. Please make sure if you need anything from your locker, you need to get that by Monday afternoon. We will be closing the building to traffic after 2 p.m. on Monday. I have a, a couple other reminders. Remember to check your email a couple times a day. Remember that Mr. Hodeck is available for MacBook and Chromebook repair at the front entrance. And I want to ask you to do one more thing between now and Monday. Check in on your quiet friends. Please reach out to somebody that you have not talked to in over a week. Make sure you make connections, make sure you keep those connections. And there are some of, there are some of our students that are pretty quiet. Let's reach out to them too. The word of the day today is pleonasm, which means the use of more words than necessary to denote mere sense, which is what our announcements are sometimes. Used in a sentence, his description of his attributes was a pleonasm. The quote of the day, if you think you are too small to have an impact, try going to sleep with a mosquito in your room. And that quote comes from Anita Roddick. Um, had a little difficulty finding some in exciting things from April 3rd in history, but Aww. I did find a few. In 1860, the first Pony Express service began between St. Joseph, Missouri and Sacramento, California. In 1882, American outlaw Jesse James, not the motorcycle guy, was killed in his home in St. Joseph, Missouri. St. Joseph, Missouri was a hopping place on April 3rd. In 1910, four men reached the summit of Mount McKinley, the highest mountain in North America. That will be your trivia question. Where is Mount McKinley? In 1922, Joseph Stalin was appointed General Secretary of the Russian Communist Party by an ailing Vladimir Lenin. And in 1973, this is a really important one for all of you, the first mobile phone call was made in downtown Manhattan by Motorola employee Martin Cooper to the Bell Labs headquarter in New Jersey, and the rest is history. Last thing for today, the joke of the day. How much did the pirate pay for his earrings? Arr, matey. A buccaneer.
Don't forget to follow Father Kevin's escapades in the Ministry Minute at 2.30 this afternoon. Have a great day. Little town, everyone's in lockdown. All alone, they remain at home. Little town, full of little people, waking up to say, Stay home! Stay home! Stay home! Stay home! There comes old Bernie and he's got Corona. So why the heck is he outside? Walks around as though he's well I've got corona With a sanitizer gel He's gonna get us all infected Good morning, Belle Good morning, Joe Why aren't you quarantined? I'm not sick I'm just on my way to Costco To buy some toilet paper Before we're out That's and... nice Sandy, the Purell Hurry up I've yet to see a reckless fool Quite like her Without a mask or gloves She goes In a bright princess she's been And she thinks no one had seen She's, she's gonna, gonna get, get us all infected That is bad Stay home With you At least six feet They close our schools It's now a ghost town The stock so now just fell 800 points You again Good morning, Albert. I'm done reading the book Did you wash your hands? I don't remember. Is there anything new? Ha ha ha, I'm serious. Wash your hands No worries. Okay, I'll take this one Another Stephen King? Are you sure? I'm not feeling well. I've got a fever, a terrible cough. I think I've got corona. Fine. Take the book. Just don't come near me. But sir... Don't touch me. Thank you. Thank you very much. And there she goes with runny nose and fever. She never covered when she sneezed. She forgets to wash her hands. Though she claims to comprehend the dangers of corona that is there. Just another flu You see True Now the death rate's higher But we can't control when we will die So let it be Corona isn't just another virus And yet she doesn't seem to she does look kind of pale, and her breathing seems to fail. Very different from the rest of us. She's nothing like the rest of us. She's